Today, we're heading to Roanoke to see what they have to offer in their sharing economy. First, we will be renting a bike through bike sharing website Spinlister. And then we'll be getting a ride through probably the most common sharing economy app, Uber. To rent a bike on Spinlister, you create an account and search for bike listings in your area. Aaron Garland happens to charge $25 for an hour, $45 for a full day, or $90 for an entire week. You simply enter your credit card information and Spinlister handles the transaction. Since Spinlister is not available in the Rockbridge area, we drove 54 miles down to Roanoke. When we arrived, we were greeted at the door by our bike sharer, Aaron. Hi, Aaron. Yeah. Hi, Patrick. He showed us the Cannondale Synapse carbon yeah. fiber road bike we'd be renting from him that day. He told us that he's been a Spinlister member for a year and that we're the first people uh, to rent from him. But, uh, um, I think that maybe it's maybe more popular in other areas and not as big of a thing in Roanoke. I figured that if I had it sitting in the basement, then uh, I might as well let somebody use it. Aaron also told us that he uses other sharing economy services, like Uber and Airbnb. But in those cases, he's not the driver or host. We headed towards Roanoke River Greenway, a scenic bike path down the street. Aaron, an avid biker himself, suggested that we try it out. We spent the remainder of our hour-long rental period before returning the bike. Then, it was time to try out a different sharing economy service. Just a ride. Yeah. So we're standing here at the corner of 13th Street and Campbell here in Roanoke. So suppose you need a ride to the airport. Well, luckily, Uber is available here, and it's just a click on the phone away. To get a ride from Uber, download the app, create an account, and enter your credit card information. There will be no transaction between you and the driver, unless you decide to tip. After requesting our ride, the Uber app tells us that our driver is John. He's driving a Chevy Impala and is five minutes away. Hey sure enough, he arrived on time. We asked John to bring us to the Roanoke airport. Then, we asked him what it was like to drive an Uber in Roanoke. He said that he's earned as much as $600 in a week. His busiest night is Friday, spending most of that time driving riders to and from bars. After about 12 minutes, we reached our destination. Oh, yeah. <laughs> After our ride, Uber emailed me a receipt. The cost was $12. The same ride would have cost $16 to $18 plus tip had we taken a cab. So that concludes our sharing economy experience here in Roanoke.